Hello, this is Arnel. In this blog, we'll see posterior wall myocardial infarction. An elderly with hypertension and dyslipidemia came in due to chest pain, no nausea and vomiting, and claimed to have been driving for hours with a BP of 140 over 90. Coronary angiogram revealed 95% stenosis of the left circumflex artery and a stent was deployed. Echo done revealed normal systolic function with an EF in the 60s. This is a case of posterior wall MI. Posterior wall MI, MI may occur in isolation in about 4% of cases. It may present as ST changes in the right precordial leads V1 to V3 as horizontal ST segment depression as seen in this case, a tall upright T wave, a tall wide R wave, or R wave amplitude or S wave amplitude ratio greater than 1. The culprit lesion may be the right coronary artery posterior descending branch or the left circumflex artery as seen in this case.